All right, this is Crota giving you a 2v2 commentary between Psycho Cash versus Remind and Lucifron here on Twisted Metal. Now, and the gate. Now we have Psycho. Um, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and go to Psycho's view. Turn off Fog of War so that we and turn on Online's color so that it's a, a little bit easier to see. So here we have um, Cash, um, Cash and Psycho versus. Uh, Lucifron that's spawning on the 11 o'clock position, Remind spawning at the 7 o'clock position, Psycho is at the I believe 5 o'clock position, and Cash is over here on the uh, 1 o'clock position. We have a Demon Hunter coming out from um, Psycho. Meanwhile, we have a Demon Hunter coming out from Remind. So we have close spawns for a mirror match. We have a Blade Master and a uh, Blade Master and a Grunt coming out for Lucifron and the other team as well. And we have Red versus Blue. That's how we're going to be. It's going to be Red and Teal versus or blue and teal versus red so now here we have the demon hunters just trying to exchange blows on each other mana burning back back and forth on each other it looks as though it's a fairly fairly even match it looks as though psycho's trying to run back to his base meanwhile we have the blade master trying to come back out uh blade master is going to come in and come in and from uh who's that i cannot click on him because he's wind walking from lucifron so lucifron as the red orc and now we have the teal trying to do, go ahead and trying to take down the red orc as Cash is trying to take down those units. The demon hunter is getting awfully low on hit points. We have a no. We have a nice critical strike and we have a break. So Remind is going to go have to force and try to pull back. Meanwhile, we have Lucifron and and the demon hunter trying to run away. So both demon hunters in in some slight trouble. Now we're going to have the blade masters. Yep, the blade masters is going to go ahead and try to come back on each other. Looks as though we're going to have. Um, Psycho is trying to go ahead and trying to use a speed scroll, able to pull back a little bit. Oh, we had a scroll of scroll of regeneration on loose on the shadow stalker, but he he is able to now barely run away with his enhanced speed. Meanwhile, we have a wisp getting destroyed by um, by these natural creeps. So there's a lot of action here going on with four agility heroes. Um, a lot more action than I'd like to care to commentate, but I've always liked two v two games. Here we have the shadow stalker. It looks like he's going to pick up a boots of speed and perhaps a staff of teleportation. Uh, not quite sure. You're just a boots of speed. Meanwhile, we have a boots of speed purchased on Cash's um, Blade Master. So both Shadows um, and the team, the blue and teal teams, uh, Psycho and Cash, do have boots of speed. Meanwhile, Lucifron and Remind does not have boots of speed at this point. We have Grunts coming in. Lucifron's Grunts, one of them, is in the red. Here we have Demon Hunter, uh, awfully low on hit points, trying to run away. Is he going to be able to outrun that Huntress? It looks as though he will, trying to regenerate some hit points as he tries to get some distance in between. Now Huntress coming in across the map as well. So we have Huntresses and Grunts coming from both sides. Demon Hunter trying to do some damage against Cash. Remind, re meanwhile, back we have Psycho's Demon Hunter taking some, a good amount of damage, trying to run away. Remind, Remind and his Demon Hunter is going to go ahead and try to harass the base. And we have Huntresses coming out as well. So there's going to be two Huntresses and a Demon Hunter coming to harass the base. Meanwhile, back towards the top, we have Cash trying to take down Lucifron's, uh, Lucifron's base. We have a breaking of the healing on the Grunt and the Blade Master. Blade Master down to 98 hit points, 95 hit points. Well, the Blade Master is another sp speed scroll trying to take out some units. Those peasants now mining very, very quickly. Meanwhile, back towards the south, we have Blade Master trying to run to the south, trying to heal. And back here, we have the Moonwell trying to get repaired by these Wisps, but those Wisps are going to take some bouncing damage. Unfortunately, the Wisp does go to pull to the back now, trying to trying to re-repair. Meanwhile, Huntress is coming out, and we have a Demon Hunter trying to harass. So, a major harassment. All the opponent's units are not in their correct base. Quick detonation. Demon Hunter trying to take out these units. Meanwhile, the Blade Master is going ahead and try to pull back. So, it looks as though this looks like it's two 1v1 mirror match games commentating at the same time. Demon Hunter trying to pull out as a Demon Hunter from Remind is going to go ahead and come in. Cycle is going to be forced to pull back out. Demon, mana burn, only only able to mana burn 15 units, trying to take on those Ancient of Lores. Ancient of Lores quickly stop. Ancient of Wonders, a, a quick rebuilding of those Ancient of Lore. That Ancient of Lore is going to get canceled one more time. Ancient of War trying to rejoin in on the fight, and those units are going to try to go ahead and pull to the back. Meanwhile, we have Blade Master trying to come in, trying to Oh, trying to come in and try to harass, trying to come in across the map. We have the Blade Master of Re uh, Lucifron trying to get some creeping in. The Blade Master is about to get to level 2 or perhaps level 2 if he's able to take out that Overseer. Meanwhile, we have the uh, Demon Hunter and the Huntress is trying to come in as well. We have a Naga Sea Witch coming from Remind. So Remind does have a Naga Sea Witch. Meanwhile, we have the Blade Master trying to exchange blows to the back. Both of them are level 1. Um, it looks as though Lucifron... Um, was able, uh, was not able to get the kill and Cash was able to get the kill so Cash does have some experience forced to do a teleportation out meanwhile we have the Demon Hunter and Huntress just trying to come back in Maybe, perhaps they will be able to get, uh, stop the healing on that Blade Master Blade Master's healing is stopped and, and Blade Master is fresh out of healing cells <sighs>
Okay, Demon Hunter and Demon Hunter and Nagasi, which are gonna go ahead and try to creep out this camp. We have um, Demon Hunter doesn't have any experience, so that we will not get level two from this camp. Meanwhile, we have a Shadow Hunter coming in from Cash. Demon Hunter, Shadow Stalker, um, currently sitting at Tree of Ages, so is able to produce Ancient of Lores and getting a Priestess of the Moon. So no longer a mirror match. We do have a Blade Master and a Shadow Hunter coming out from Lucifron, I believe. Yes, Lucifron does have um, a couple heroes now. We have um, who is that? Um, cash coming in. We have a hex on the Naga Sea Witch. The Naga Sea Witch is gonna is gonna take a good amount of damage. Naga Sea Witch trying to run away, trying to get to the top. We have a hundred is trying to go, trying to grab to the top, and we have a staff of preservation on the Naga Sea Witch. So the Naga Sea Witch able to get back in time without any major damage. Meanwhile, we have the Blade Master still currently sitting on level one. Shadow Hunter level one. Demon Hunter level one. And Naga Sea Witch hunt, Naga Sea Witch level one for the. I would all just call this the red team. Demon Hunter level one for the blue team. Along with the Priestess of the Moon, Blade Master is level one, and Shadow Hunter is level one. Not many, not many real, not real creeping going on at this point, and no real damage going on at this point. Priestess of the Moon. It looks as though the Ancient of War wants to creep out this Null Mercenary camp, as the Demon Hunter, as the Blade Master, and the Orc is going to go ahead and try to, and Cash is going to go ahead and try to creep out this camp as well. So both players trying to get some creeping in, trying to be able to get those heroes advantages. Meanwhile, we have an Ancient of War trying to creep out the Merchant Shop. We have a Dust of Appearance being used, and that Troll Ward Lord is going to go down. And we have, and I believe Rune Bracer is being dropped. I don't know who, if they were sold or picked up. Too many heroes to click to figure out who has them. If I will, I just believe it will just be sold as no real units are going to be doing. There's no death coil or bolts coming in. Now we have a scroll speed trying to come in. Oh, and and the snare and the demon hunter is going to be forced to teleport that ancient of war most likely going to go down oh that patrol berserker trying to run away that blade master may be able to get in get blocked by his own tree meanwhile we have the huntress is coming into the back uh, we have an ensnare on that troll berserker that troll berserker is going to be in trouble he's trying to run to the back trying to join in on the fight that blade master it looks as though uh psycho does not want to commit meanwhile cash is trying to go ahead and try to creep out the other goblin goblin merchant shop and we have the whole entire army the whole entire red army with remind and lucifron creeping coming in knocking on this knocking on the steps of psycho's base it looks as though cash may have to force a teleportation if they do hit and push they are going to go ahead and push and now we have the um we have the huntress is trying to take down those ancient of lures that huntress should probably pull to the back try to get try to get in away from that damage and we dry is now coming and trying to do some extra damage we do have a scroll of teleportation coming in one ancient of lore goes down and where is it going to land it lands right outside and we have ensnare going down we have a spirit link going down we have a couple of dispels a couple of detonates coming from the wisp of the back trying to prevent any healing or any or any uh spirit link a couple, a demon hunter of cycle is in the red and now gets a quick heal we have units all over the place a lot of red and blue just trying to fight each other demon hunter um, is taking a good amount of damage cycles demon hunter is ensnared it looks as though it is going to go down to the level two is he going to go by a potion and um, un unknown at this time priestess of the moon is now sitting at level two so we have level two um, heroes and level one heroes coming across the map and demon hunter is trying to sit in the back shadow hunter and um, getting some nice heals across and it looks as though cash and um, looks like blue's army is going to be able to pull ahead there is a lot of um, units in the red and they are not being focused down there's just so much going on on this map right now the um, a psycho's demon hunter is currently sitting at 88 hit points does have a potion of healing and down goes the blade master of lucifron i believe or remind i can't tell at this point and um, remind okay so lucifron's um, demon uh, blade master goes down demon hunter of lucifron is is going down as well is going down to 12 hit points 13 hit points down to two hit points and goes down as well so lucifron and remind both lose their first hero demon hunter and blade master is gone remind's gonna probably lose that as well gets the level three on the blade master that blade master trying to run back trying to heal um, is gonna, does have a couple moon wells to use and and it looks at those that dryad's trying to go after and that dryad is going to go down as well wow it, it's just an exciting fight so far cash is going to go ahead and come back in we have the units being picked off units being chased and it looks as lucifron is going to lose another raider and spirit link blade master trying to go after that level three naga sea witch naga sea witch get is do we have enough no no mana for a hex trying to get it down trying to get it, it does not look like it's going to go down in play and we have ancient of we have cash giving psycho 600 lumber to rebuild those ancient of lores and the demon hunter is now trying to get to level three um i'm going to use this break in the uh, pause in the game to go ahead and stay tuned for part two of this replay and it looks just as a quick wrap up there we had some great matches and you know what i'm just going to pause this <sighs> stay tuned for part two